Hello grade four learners and parents. Thank you so much for joining the video today. For today, for the natural science lesson, we're going to be learning about the states of matter. Now in the previous lesson, you learned about that the states of matter were solids, liquids, and gases. Well, for this lesson, we want to do an experiment. And I want you to try and look at all the ingredients that I have on the table here and find out which one represents each state of matter. All right, for this experiment, what I want you to do before we start, I want you to please take out a piece of paper and a pencil to write down everything that you see. So what I first want, what are the objects that you need for this? Right, so over here, we have bicarbonate of soda. You're gonna need that or baking soda. What you also need are some balloons. I suggest having two or three just in case. Have an empty plastic bottle. As you can see, I have used a Coca-Cola bottle because it's easy to use. Don't drink Coke. What you're also going to need is some white vinegar. Right. What I have done is, as you can see, I have placed some tissues out on the table just in case I spill. You don't want to be messing up your table at home to the parents. I'm sorry if they do. So, what you are going to need to do, as you can see what I've done, is I've poured the vinegar into the Coke bottle around about that much. Right, it doesn't need to be too much because you don't want the Coke bottle to be overflowing. What I have also done is I have poured the bicarbonate of soda into the balloon. All right, I have done this already, just to make sure that you aren't wasting any time. All right, what I want you to do before we start, now that you've written down everything that you see and everything that you need, what do you think I'm going to do in this experiment? I'm gonna give you two seconds. All right, with this experiment, okay, what I'm going to do, and I hope you're writing this down, write down the steps. I'm going to place the balloon over the lid of the Coke bottle. Like that, okay. Now before I lift up the balloon and pour it into the vinegar, I want you to write down what do you think your hypothesis is for this experiment? I'm gonna give you a few seconds. Maybe ask your parents. Ask them what you think might happen. All right. If you have paused the video, very well done. What we are going to do now is we are going to pour the bicarbonate of soda into the vinegar. So you're going to lift up the balloon and pour it in. And as you can see, look what happens, okay? Look what is happening. I hope you're taking notes of what is happening. All right, look how the balloon has expanded. So, for this experiment, I want you to think, if we had to think of each ingredient as a state of matter, what do you think the vinegar represents? What do you think the bicarbonate of soda represents? And then, where do you think the gas is in this experiment? Where did the gas come from? All right. So as you can see, when we poured the bicarb of soda into the vinegar, okay, it created a chemical reaction which released gas. Okay, the gas, it rose up and expanded the balloon. Right, I hope that you enjoyed that video. Please give it a try yourself. Please write down all your findings. I want to know what you find in your experiments. What I also want you to try and do, maybe mix some things up. What happens if you try a different type of vinegar? What happens if you, do, if you use less vinegar or maybe more vinegar? What happens if you use less bicarb soda or more bicarb soda and baking soda? All right, how does your balloon expand? Try different types of balloons, try different types of containers. What I want to see, I want you to please create a video of your experiment, okay? Or you can take pictures of your experiment but do it step by step so that we see what you have done and how you have done it. I hope that you've enjoyed this experiment and I'll see you in the next.